So, what do you know? It turns out to be fucking true. You can't take the sky away from me. <clears throat> it's so fucking vast that nobody can. Take away one universe, collapse it into a singularity, and it just goes on and on and on. Beyond the void, where nothing interacts, there's another one. Beyond that, another and another and another. Suck me into a black hole. You still haven't taken the sky away because it's going to be all above. Always. So what is it? What is this meme going through all your heads? Homo sapiens, in particular the uh, parasitic ruling losers. I'm not even going to waste my time talking to those that empower you with your, your blind obedience. Your civil servitude. You're gonna go with the old Borgie plan. Destroy it all. Wipe it out. With everybody around you shouting and banging on your fucking noodle. No! 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 You're gonna wreck it all. Even your fucking dad had to look back on and say, Fuck now, were we ever fucking idiots? We had bear ice and we fucked it all. Now we don't even have a fucking planet. We gotta go and fucking try and create habitats on dead worlds. You know, we were told what we were doing. We had people, we had others, we had beings smashing into your head. What the fuck are you doing? Wake up, open your fucking eyes and look at what you're doing. And it's like something got over you, took control of you, made you destroy it anyhow. And what was it gonna plead? Well, that says they would have a lesson for the road and the motivation to go serving life out into the universe. As per the first meaning of life. Is that how it is? Is that how it is with you stupid fucks? Go for bankrupt. Take all these beautiful life forms and take them all. Just as you could have one more defect to split your minds. Come back here, guys. That's what your species is all about, and I guess that's why it was aptly nicknamed by those that, without permission, stole my descendants' gene samples and Okay, yep, and I guess some of them must have whacked off on the fucking Petri dish or ovulated into it or whatever. Or sneezed and some of their uh, DNA got in there, I don't know. It does really sound like their way. Well. I suppose all I can try and do is set an example of recording it for others and we've already sent it out. Oh, mine are out past Alpha Centauri already, my comms, over this particular subject. So. Do your thing and do it ma knowingly. Because you're not ever getting another life world. You don't. You basically will be forever under a 
arrest, a life sentence, I guess you would call it, for committing homicide. Some of you first degree, and I guess some of you will be third degree manslaughter or whatever. <clears throat> Mass, everything. But, that's your wills, and that's what you very many are quite willing and knowingly wanting to do and I guess that's that other personality meme that was installed in is this nonsense about a second life that you had the spirit you create out of your imagination and all gone. Go back to truth and survival eventually. I'll put it there for you or look in at it. I told you what you already did. You speed it up. Magnetar dynamo that we installed deep down as you're playing around with fission and fusion atomic weaponry in the crust and the sea in the air above in the magnetosphere fucking fools I'm inducing Sharp, fast neutron spikes and other shit you're not really ready to deal with yet. And you took a thousand years off of the planet, you know, you would have had a thousand motherfucking years, and you would have had at least till 3,000. Depending on seeing space weather. I don't know at all. To get up to Star Trek grade and Evacuate. I think some of you know it. Deep down. And you just want to commit mass suicide for everything and everyone. Because you don't have to deal with it. Because you never actually really ever dealt with anything in your life. That's why you were, you know, basically fell into everything. That's that subliminal influence, and we'll get back to that now, because that's the second time I've talked to it on this chat. I've talked to it many times before. Yeah, the fucking course dealers that set your, your mutators up to take the rap. We're creating you, and you for ruining this place. Well ahead, and destroying the harvest. Earth and his brother of the moon, eh? Well, you talking monkeys sure do give a spin to doom of the powers. <sighs> well, um, Prosper and live as long as you can, eh? Get going. There's your two in the Bible there. Preach to heavens. Preach to heaven from the rooftops. I only find two people like that. That's um, Virgin Galactic there, uh, what's um, um, Richard uh, and uh, Elon Musk, Rich Richard Branson and Elon Musk. Sorry boys, you know how I am when I think people's faces and match them up with names when it comes to you humans. Injuries, eh? Well, uh, well, um, well multiple combined. <clears throat> I don't got a G spot. I never really did, but, you know. <clears throat> yeah. So, there you go. Don't chew bubblegum. So I might just as well start kicking your asses. Mars is your first step. Get going. Those are the only two private spacemen of, of note so far. Uh, apparently there's some space women on the rise, and uh, let's get going. You want a data dump? 
get fucking going. I'm taking everybody that has resources. I'm stealing swords to make plowshares. So you rich cocksuckers are on notice. I've been getting a hold of each and every one of you. Beginning to assess what you wish me to see about you. And uh, whether you do or don't, I'm going to do the same anyhow. I'm sure you guys know me well enough by now. I'm a kicking. You got the resources, those are the earth's resources. The earth wants to serve life, right? Right to the moment its singularity freezes into the first state of being. So, get up going. We'll see up there. Even though I can't go. Uh, we'll make all that time or something, eh? Peace out, y'all.